Can you please tell me why my daughter and I are here? I understand why my ex is here, but why us too? Let's just say it was my gun. Let, let's just say it was my bullet. It was in my hand. I was at fucking work. Look, man, I was just a cop for the school. Everything I know, I already told you five years ago. Um, so I woke up, then I went to school, and then a bad thing happened, and then I went home. It was like every other day. I uh, was running a little bit behind. We woke up, I fed my daughter breakfast, I dropped her off in front of the school, and, um, and the school cop was standing in front and he escorted her in. My wife, she has this great habit of leaving our daughter at the school to the very last minute. <laughs> Always the last one there. Once again, yes, she was the only student left along with a few other teachers. They stay for the after school programs. So once my friend left, it was just me and Mrs. Arp. Melanie, your dad's here. Bye, Melanie. I know what I saw. He came running out looking suspect as hell. He reached when I told him to kneel. And in my eyes, there was no one else that could have done that to Mrs. Art. Come on, man! Put your hands in there! It was not me, man! It was not me! Put your hands in there! I swear it was... The only thing that stops a bad guy with a gun is a good guy with a gun. I tried as hard as I could to block her from my ex's passions. Is anyone else in there? I'm here. Mrs. Arp is laying down. She can't get up. Um, I I've only ever seen dead people on my dad's TV. It's kind of different in real life. Come on, let's go. We're gonna go outside, we'll call your parents, okay? After the incident, Avery had to stay and answer some questions for the police. But she couldn't. She couldn't even talk. All right, so they just let me know that they have no leads, so there's no reason for detaining Avery or keeping her for question. So we're done here. We can go. I can, I can get her home. Yes. All right, thank you. Okay. All right, buckle up, sweetie. How are you feeling? You okay? My ex is the one that loves that stupid gun, okay? I'm the one that makes sure that they're put away properly every single time. You were in a hurry that morning. Did you remember that time? You can't even imagine what it's like to get a call and hear that your daughter's been in a school shooting. The nightmares that I have and the nightmares that I still have. It's illegal to hold me here without telling me why. And I know you know that. There's new evidence from ballistics. The bullet found on the head of Miss Arp has the markings of a Smith & Wesson. And you happen to be one of three owners of this weapon within a 30 mile radius. That's bullshit. We've already checked the alibis of every owner and they all check out. Including yours. Do you know whose prints are on the weapon? Yes. Mine and my ex's, obviously. There's a set of third prints, ma'am. I never meant to kill her! I just want her to stop picking on me all the time!